We are following a developing story out of Houston for you today. Sunday was a very tough day for the Houston Texans. Not only did the team lose to the Colts, but the coach left the game at halftime. That's right. Houston coach Gary Kubiak collapsed as he was heading to the locker room. An ambulance took him to a Houston hospital. Sylvia Rincon is live in the newsroom with the very latest on this story. And Sylvia, what's the coach's condition this morning as far as we know? We have been monitoring this one because everybody, of course, is concerned about the uh, Kubiak's condition at this point. Uh, we, at this hour, we know that uh, they have ruled out that it was a heart attack and that he never lost consciousness. He was weak and dizzy and did collapse, but he did went, go through a number of specialists. And so far, uh, we are still waiting on the very latest update regarding that. But again, they eliminated the most serious of things, which was a heart attack. The 52-year-old coach is with his family at a Houston hospital this morning. Uh, it was definitely all way too much to handle for the Texans. Uh, they ended up, uh, the Colts ended up rallying for a 27-24 victory over them. Texans GM Rick Smith did say that the coach did admit to feeling lightheaded and dizzy. He was evaluated by a number of doctors. Smith said he hoped Kubiak would be given a clean bill of health as soon as today and expects him to be back with the team um, this week, but we're still waiting to hear official word, of course. On the field, Andrew Luck tossed three second-half touchdowns. That's when the Colts rallied from an 18-point deficit. They end the game and ended up winning it all last night. So it was an unfortunate condition for a situation for the Texans, for sure. We'll keep you posted on the very latest. Reporting live from the newsroom, I'm Silver Inkle on News 4, San Antonio.